It's now time for Trivia Tracks with yours truly, Price Robertson. This edition of Trivia Tracks is brought to you by ProMed Ambulance Services, care you can count on, and Beth Smith at Edward Jones. Edward Jones, making sense of investing, member SIPC. This well-remembered television western series was one of the few productions of Mark Goodson and Bill Todman outside of their game show ventures. The Rebel, which hit the airwaves in the fall of 1959, star Nick Adams as young Confederate Army veteran Johnny Yuma, an aspiring writer. Haunted by the memories of the American Civil War, Yuma, in search of inner peace, roams the American West, specifically the Texas Hill Country and the South Texas Plains. He keeps a journal of his adventures and fights injustice where he finds it with a revolver and a sawed-off double-barrel shotgun. Nick Adams co-created the series with Andrew J. Finnedy, who later developed two other westerns for television, Branded and Hondo. After the show's original run on ABC finished in June of 1961, NBC aired it as a summer replacement series from June to September 19. 19- 1962. The show's theme song, composed by Richard Markowitz and Andrew Fennedy, was performed by Johnny Cash during the main and end titles. In reruns and for royalty purposes, the song was replaced by the DeWolf Music Library track Dodge City No. 1 by Jack Trombie, which was composed in 1967, six years after the Rebel left the airwaves. Two episodes of Seinfeld reference the first line of the show's theme song. In the episode The Heart Attack, Jerry retorts to Kramer that Johnny Yuma is a rebel. For more amazing trivia, and in case you didn't catch a particular segment, you can always visit our platforms, including iHeartRadio, CastBox, Deezer, Podchaser, Podcast Addict, and even YouTube. Till next time, I'm Price Robertson. Amazed by today's trivia? Then join me for Trivia Tracks weekdays at 645 on Everybody's Country, Y95.